Welcome everyone to the video and today I feel like I have to make this video because it's very important. Special thanks out to my YouTube follower and Discord member Bay. Bay, thank you so much for posting this information. Now in the past I've talked about making your teams for events as events will net you the most amount of resources. Although every game mode is important in the game, for free-to-play players and cheap-to-play players, your resources are very important. Events used to be the number one way to get the most green summon tokens. But look what just happened. Look what just happened. Someone, Bay, has just gotten the new update with the events. This is easy. This is, well, this is normal mode. Look what happens when you get first place. You get more shards of torment. However, where are the gold summon? Where are the where are the the gold dragons are nerfed? So there's less gold dragons and the green summon tokens are missing. You're getting uh energy refills. Okay. I guess that'll go hand in hand with trials if some of us ever get it. I still haven't gotten it on either account. Um, yeah, the t the summon tokens, green summon tokens are missing. This is hard. As you can see, the gold dragons have been nerfed. And the summon tokens are missing. Something interesting happens when you go to Treacherous and Kingslayer which if you already have a good event team, you may want to consider boosting. But if you are an up and coming player, do not focus on events for your main team. Look what happens, Treacherous. If you get the first place in Treacherous, you get two legendary gear items. And the new thing about legendary gear items is that you will get random ones. So. The chances of you getting two of the same are slim to none. I'm not going to say slim to none, but very slim. So you will get two legendary gear items in Treacherous. And then when you go to Kingslayer, when you go to Kingslayer, you will get two legendary items in first place and two legendary items in second place. So, where does this leave us in the game? Let's go ahead and pull up what should we be building towards. And I'll have to say, build towards whatever you have fun with. Right now, the best way to get resources is going to be through trials, through your daily logins. There are going to be bonuses for doing the King's Road. So, a quick um, tip. I already claimed two of these, but save these weekly goals and don't claim them until the update happens. Because when you get past to the bonus, you will have a chance to get five purple tokens, um, one purple token, or one green token. And you might get red as well. I'm not sure. But you have a good chance to get better summons in there for completing more of the uh, King's Road. So save your weekly goals for that update. So let's look at what we have. We have dragons. Dragons give you one purple. And if you get high enough dragon, you'll get gold uh, dragons as well. A little bit like 20, 5, 10, 20, somewhere in that range. So you're getting one purple from there. Your daily goals, you're going to get one purple. And if you finish the King's Road, then you're going to get bonus on there. Um, let's see. I, I think that leaves us with raid. I think that leaves us with raid. And they want us competing with raids because raids, raids are the way to get the most resources now. Um, I'm in gold one. You can get um, four greens. And five purples. It's not the greatest. I actually wanted a buff for this. I thought they should have buffed it. But yeah, I think right now the way to go is to build your raid team. So if you are free to play, cheap to play, 
Ice is strong. Fire is strong. Um, Free City's just got nerfed. Um, Tyrion just got nerfed. We're in a new age. We're in a new age. And the other thing I forgot to mention was in the events, in Kingslayer level 20, instead of five of the green tokens, you will only receive one token. I don't know if this is spread out along the way, but... Rewards just got nerfed. So we're in a new age. I said it in a previous video. Build your teams for events. Right now, if you already have a strong event team, you're probably going to get the legendary gear anyway. And if that's what you want, go for it. But if you're an up-and-coming player, you need power. You need stars on your characters. And you need teams that work well together. I am going to recommend going for raid the best you possibly can. I mean, once you start hitting gold three, you'll start earning the green summons. And again, trials helps too. So I don't know anything about trials because I don't have it, but trials will help you too. So new age, comment below. Let me know what you think of the changes. This has just been released to me by my friend Bay. Thank you so much for joining the server. And you are awesome for posting that. Take care, guys.